guys, what's up? I'm gonna stop my cat from playing with these toys real quick because she's gonna make a mess. <laughs> Gus, can we not? Uh, I got a little special episode today, as you might have noticed. I switched guitars to this uh, semi hollow that Ivan has sent me from my kind of home studio playing guitar, recording stuff. And I switched heads to the Rock Verb 100. It was actually the first orange head that I bought way back when Understanding What We've Grown to Be came out and on the I'm Alive headliner that we did for that CD, that was the uh, first tour that I was able to use this set in. Whew, was I stoked. So, in honor of that, I'm gonna be giving you a little three song lesson today on my favorite clean guitar parts from Understanding What We've Grown to Be. So, first off, I'll go with one of my personal favorites on the CD of Warren Side, it's track six. Um, it's really simple, actually. So, this uses all these five strings, anything but the highest one. We'll start on the second fret, so you bar these two. We'll go to four on this, open on the next, three on the next, play them in a row. Sounds pretty nice. The other chord in that, just lift your finger up. Super simple. That's actually no effect, so put a little juice on it, we'll see. pretty early on in the song and uh, I just I love it I always thought it sounded really pretty and I love the way that this uh, the clean channel on this head sounds and so uh, I guess in spirit of that uh, track three what I wish I never had has a pretty cool clean part in it as well um, it's just these top two maybe a little bit of this four string we'll start on the fifth fret and then the first fret it's a big stretch if you have small hands if you're maybe a female my little sister plays guitar very small hands can't really play it but uh, so it goes five, one, three, down to one. It's a little weird. You kind of have to bunch your fingers up. So you kind of put them all together. So you go five, three, one, back up to three. last two make sure you hit this string it is open and uh, I guess a a song on, on understanding maybe the least popular maybe not the least popular one of my favorites it was kind of a continuation song called views that never cease um, the uh, the intro to that was one of my uh, my more favorite parts so we'll start with this open string five seven on the next string down five on the next string down eight on the next string down then open as well. Pretty simple. Move this pinky that was on your eight just up two strings. Keep it on eight. So really simple. two years I played that part. Nailed it. <laughs> Anyways, that is the end of this episode. I'm going to figure out what song I'm going to play next for you guys and uh, see you in a couple days.